Hello again, Spartan Nation. We're here with another weekly installment of our Athlete Spring Sports Spotlight. This week, we are joined by two senior members of our boys' volleyball team. So, guys, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourselves. Hi, I'm Morgan Dykstra. I'm a senior at Oakland Community High School. I'm uh, Munir Ta, also a senior, Oakland Community High School. All right, welcome, guys. Thanks for coming on with us here. Um, so we'll start with the first question we always ask is, uh, and Morgan will throw it to you first here. How long have you been playing volleyball? And then what kind of got you involved there? And if you play any other sports, you can tell us about that too. So, Morgan? All right. Um, I've been in volleyball for five years. It started in eighth grade. And what got me involved and interested into it was Coach Hunt pressured me for since sixth and seventh grade. He always wanted me to play. I always kind of denied it. But then when my eighth grade came around, I finally decided to join. And I've always liked it. And then getting with a good team, especially with Muneer, I've always loved it. Um, some other sports I've been a part of in Oklahoma High School is cross country. I was also in that for four years. So how tall were you in sixth grade, Morgan, that Hunt was? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I think I was about uh, around the six-foot area. In sixth grade, there you go. <laughs> how about you, Muneer? Uh, I started playing volleyball in my freshman year. I had a couple of friends like asked me to come try out for the team and I listened to them and then I liked it ever since then. I also played basketball for my first two years of high school, but I've been playing basketball my whole life. So I like that too. All right. Very good. Very good. Um, so think back to your time with, uh, with Spartan athletics here, could be volleyball or any other sports that you've uh, participated in. Do you have a favorite memory as a Spartan athlete. So, Munir, let's go to you first. My favorite memory is probably just like every day in practice, putting at work, you know, making sure that the team gets better as well as everybody individually. It okay. helps us all as a program. Awesome. Morgan, how about you? My favorite memory from volleyball would be the games, of course. I mean, especially the competition that we go against with each other, trying to see who can get the most points or be the best player. Um, but my favorite memory of all time would be my cross country uh, conference race where I'd PR to get a 1901 on my race on my uh, race time and three mile race. Very cool. Um, you guys are playing sports all the time, you know, um, being locked up at home, you kind of miss getting active and getting out there. So when you're not playing your sport, whether it's during quarantine or not, you know, or otherwise, what what keeps you busy? What are your hobbies? What are your interests? Morgan, how about you? My hobbies that I do, I play a lot of video games or I will rollerblade around town. Um, sometimes I'll go to rinks when they're open and play hockey with my friends. Very good. Munir? Yeah, I'm definitely always looking for like basketball gyms that are still open to always try to get extra games in or whatever. And definitely like watching Netflix, staying at home. What are we streaming? What's our favorite right now? What are we binge watching? Just started All American. Okay, very good. Kind of late, but. <laughs> um, so you know, think back. It could be an athletic influence. It could be just life in general. Um, think back and try to try to tell us about who is your biggest influence in your life, and that, and then why that is. Morgan, how about you? The biggest person, the biggest influence that I have on me is my grandfather. Um, he's always been like very important to me, and especially with all he does and supports me in life, it's brought me a long way. Family's definitely important. How about you, Munir? My biggest influence has got to be my teammates. They're always bringing me up, and they always trust me to play with them, so that definitely means a lot. Puts an impact in my game. Yeah, for sure. It's definitely, uh, especially in this time, one of those pieces of being part of an athletic team that we definitely miss, right? Yeah. Um, think back. Let's think back to school. Four years of it here at Oakland. Uh There's got to be a favorite teacher or a favorite class that you've had. Uh, maybe a class or teacher that you're particularly missing this semester. Um, so, do you have a favorite class, favorite teacher? Uh, Munir, how about you? Uh, I'll say my favorite teacher probably got to be Miss O'Day. Her class is always fun. It was never really a day that it wasn't a fun day in that class. So. I enjoyed that class a lot. How about you, Morgan? My favorite teacher would have to be Mr. Gurney and Mr. Kenny. I can't really pick a favorite between those two. 
And my favorite class is uh, PLTW. That's very cool. Um, you know, your seniors on a team, um, you've been with Spartan Athletics for a long time now. Would you have any messages uh, that you'd like to send out to your teammates or your coaches or, or just our Spartan family in general during this tough time? How about you, Morgan? Um, if, for people that are starting off next year as a freshman during any sport, it's always try your hardest. And just because you're younger does not mean you can get to a top spot. The coaches really look for that. And I would say Coach Hunt, my volleyball coach, and you, Crying, you've been very impactful on my high school year. Well, it's great to work with athletes like you guys for sure. How about you, Monier? Monier? I'd just say to always put the work in, even in a time like this. You can always find ways to get better and uh, just stay connected. Very good. You know, it's, and how about specifically to those uh, like lower levels, uh, your, your, your freshman, your sophomore on the volleyball program? What advice do you have, you know, as a veteran of that program? What advice do you have to them uh, moving forward? Munir, how about you? Uh, just to always work hard to get to the position that you want to be in. Uh, if you if you don't like like the position that you're in, it's always good to work hard. That'll always get you to where you need to be. There you go. How about you, Morgan? Uh, I'll say some, something similar along those lines. And also, um, try every sport you can. Even if you don't know much about the sport, um, definitely go for it because you never know what you like. Awesome. Good advice from both of you, for sure. Um, so now a little bit back to you. Graduation, high school is over, we're moving on. What uh, What is in store for you guys? What are your plans after graduation? How about you, Morgan? I plan to go to college, and I'm still debating on whether I want to go to Louisiana Tech or Valparaiso. And I plan to become a mechanical engineer. Very good. Munir? I plan on going to Moraine for two years, then transferring to university, probably to study business. Very cool. Awesome. Well, once again, uh, thank you guys for coming on, giving us the opportunity to learn a bit more about you guys, our boys' volleyball program as well. Um, you know, on behalf of Spartan Athletics and, you know, the volleyball staff in particular, you know, thank you for your years of dedication to, to Spartan Athletics and, and for everything you've put into it. We definitely appreciate it. Um, hope you enjoyed it. And, uh, you know, good luck in your future. Thank you. Thank you guys for joining me once again, and thank you everyone for watching. Make sure to join us next week as we spotlight another one of our spring programs. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook, on Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube, all at OLCHS Athletics. We'll see you next week, and go Spartans.